we'll begin with the eyes open. Aware of the space around you. And some big deep breaths, breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a lovely day wherever you are and I hope you're healthy and staying safe inside. Don't need to remind you that these are weird times and yeah, today's video is going to be kind of like a day in my life in quarantine. I have nothing better to do than to film videos of myself apparently. But it is Sunday today, Sunday morning and I think I'm on day 12 of being inside. It's actually fine, we're getting through it. We're taking each day as it comes. So far I've woken up, I did a quick workout outside and then had a shower and got dressed. So I'm just kind of gonna get ready for the day. Some days I don't get ready at all. I just switch my pajamas to sweatpants. Other days I like to get ready and it kind of makes me more productive. Um, I've seen a lot of people kind of posting about getting dressed and. I don't know, sticking to your morning routine to help you have a sense of normalcy, which, yeah, kind of makes sense. So I'm just gonna do my skincare routine, put on a bit of makeup, and maybe that will help me seize the day. <laughs> today is Sunday, as I said, um, which means I obviously don't have any online classes today. I have one tomorrow, which um, I'll have to get some reading and stuff done for that. But apart from that, I don't really have anything urgent to do, of course. I'm going to start a new painting. I did some drawings for it last night. And yeah, so that'll be fun. Maybe FaceTime a friend if I get lonely. Um, but yeah, it's been quite nice being at home, honestly. I have my mum back who's cooking me lots of nice yummy Asian food. I feel like I have so much time to do everything, which is quite nice. I think I'm just going to put on some Glossier Cloud Paint to brighten up my face, you know. So far within the 12 days of being home, I haven't had a massive freak out yet about everything. The one time I did get super stressed was I've been watching Kingdom on Netflix, um, which is the South, I put way too much on, which is the South Korean zombie show. It's really good and I hate, I hate horror movies so much. Like I hate scaring myself, but I don't really find it that scary. I just find it really entertaining and the makeup is amazing. And um, the main crown prince guy is so dashing. First night that I watched that, I watched like five episodes and it was like day three of being in isolation. And then I just had like a mini breakdown that potentially the virus could turn into a zombie virus and then it would be actually apocalyptic and we would be the end of the world. But apart from that, We've been all good. That's me ready. Ready to go downstairs. Oh, I got my co-star horoscope for the day. Okay, let's see what it is. Your day at a glance. Try to accept that all relationships experience periods of closeness and distance. Wow, wow. I'd say all my relationships at the minute are experiencing distance, apart from my familiar ones because I'm currently in isolation with them. But yeah, everyone else is very far away. Nothing a FaceTime can't solve. I think that's telling me I should probably call someone today. I'll do that at some point. This is my outfit for today. I'm wearing this white bodysuit, which Ella gave me. Shout out. Cardigan, which I got in Aritzia in New York. 
and my Trady Shop Levi's. Very comfy, kind of cute, ready to launch, you know. <laughs> I did last night. It is um, Birth of Venus by Alexander Cabanel, the reference picture. It's like a section of a much larger painting. Um, I'm probably going to take out the cherubs because too hard. So I'm just going to do Venus and the water and the sky. And I've never done a study of another painting like this. The artist is like academic classicism, which I'm obviously not an academic painter but um, we shall see how it goes I'm quite I'm quite intrigued to like try the style and um, see if I can replicate it in some manner or respect so yeah I'm just gonna get my paints and stuff all set up and get started Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs> You're in my vlog. Oh my gosh, no. It's so very gross. <laughs> it's the kind of thing that like go through like these days. It was like how each Timothy Chalamet character would respond to coronavirus. And Timothy <laughs> Chalamet and the king would do that bitch like a <laughs> mute. <laughs> I just got off FaceTime with Myron. It was really lovely. Would highly recommend talking to someone, phoning a friend in this time. Um, I know that's what everyone says to do, but it actually really helps. And yeah, it's so annoying. She's so close, but so far. It is half five now, kind of nearly dinner time. Um, it's really nice being home because my mum makes all the food and <laughs> it's always ready for whenever I'm hungry. I think she's making like a veggie masaka, potentially. Excited. Probably just gonna chill for a bit until dinner's ready and then after continue painting because I haven't really done much apart from the sea and Yeah, I kind of want to do some more basically instead of um, 
meat. It's uh, lentils, green lentils, and mushrooms, um, mince. Mm. And Looks then, amazing. And then just potatoes. Uh, potatoes. What do you call it? Um, vegetables and potatoes. done so far and at first I was really not okay with it I think I put too much green and blue down which you can still see but I think I should do some more layers once it's dried but actually I'm not I'm not unhappy about progress I think I've kind of achieved the shape quite well arms maybe not but surprisingly, I think her boobs are on point. grades for Trinity so yeah no Trinity said that they're gonna like email my American professors but I'd rather they just I don't know if you ever just want a little chat you just open the app and see who's talking and you just pop in hilarious <laughs> Self-care Sunday. I'm just gonna do some journaling while I wait for this to dry and then I can wash it off and get cozy. <laughs> writing and no I just feel really anxious which I shouldn't have done I <laughs> don't recommend looking at the news um, but I was just kind of seeing the updates about how long they think this is gonna go on for in the UK and oh, I don't know sometimes I just think about the grand scheme of things and it gets so much I think it's really overwhelming but I guess there's nothing we can do about it. It is completely out of our control. I'm just gonna chill now and try to keep my mind off it. And yeah, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you enjoyed watching and I hope it wasn't too boring. <laughs> um, if you want, please feel free to like the video, leave a comment, subscribe, and all my social medias and stuff will be linked below. But um, I hope you continue to stay safe and healthy and happy and yeah, just sending my love out to each and every one of you. <laughs> <laughs>